It's time for another new Kansas City Spotlight. Here's your host, Lauren Scott. If you're dealing with chronic knee pain here at Renuva, they want to help. So I'm going to talk to Dr. Riley to see just what they have to offer. Ready to learn about some big words today. The first one being photobiomodulation. Can yeah. you tell me about that one? Yeah, it's a big word. You did it, you said it perfectly, <laughs> so that's good. So photobiomodulation is a, a fancy way of saying class four cold laser. But what it's really doing is photosynthesis. Mm -hmm. So the sun shines on the plant, plant uses energy grow. Just like today, the sun's out, or we're enjoying this beautiful day, and the, the grass is growing. And so that's from that energy from the sunlight. We're going to use energy from this laser to jumpstart the healing process. Okay, now how does that combine with regenerative cellular therapy? Yeah, so part of regenerative cellular therapy is what we call uh, PRP. Mm -hmm. all these all these acronyms yeah. right alphabet soup so PRP is platelet rich plasma and that's where we draw your blood we spin it in a centrifuge we separate the platelets and then we re-inject it back into the joint so it works phenomenal for knees shoulders elbows wrists any joint that we want to repair that has degeneration in it okay so let's go back to knees how can this help with chronic knee pain yeah so with 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 the PBM mm -hmm. and the PRP, right? All those, those alphabet soup, soup again. Uh, when we inject the, the platelet-rich plasma into that joint, it stimulates growth and repair. Mm -hmm. And then the PBM helps jumpstart that healing process by creating cellular ATP production within that joint so that it can repair the cartilage. Now, what if a patient has like bone on bone, uh, an issue like that, can you help? Uh, great question. So mm -hmm. we're gonna take x-rays and we're gonna see what phase of degeneration they're in. There's mm -hmm. four phases. If they're in phase one, two, or three, we can help them. If they're in phase four, then we have to really kind of evaluate what the next step is. Now, what if someone's been told they need surgery? Is this another option? We hear that every single day. And that's our main objective is to prevent people from surgery. Actually, the reason I do this is my mom had surgery and it didn't work. Mm -hmm. So in the other knee, I was able to prevent her from surgery. So I'm confident that we'll be able to help most of the people that come in the door, but we're always gonna take an x-ray to evaluate what phase they're in and then give them an honest answer. Okay, so you can also help with arthritis or degeneration, right? Exactly, and that's what I was saying is that there's different phases. So depending on where they're at, we're gonna evaluate that and let them know specifically. All right, if people wanna learn more, make a, uh, an appointment here, how can they do that? Yeah, so all the information is at the screen, there's a QR code, there's a website, there's phone number, there's lots of ways for you to get, uh, for the patients to get a hold of us, and we're here to help. This Kansas City Spotlight has been paid for by Renuva Back and Pain Centers.